attorneys can contribute so much uh, to public life and to, to really making our government work, including uh, seeking election to public office. When I ran for office, I ran for state rep and I ran in a special election. And can I tell you that it meant so much to people that I, I guess I looked maybe young to them, but I, you know, knock on the door and when I would say I'm an attorney, they're like, oh, you're an attorney? I always felt it was a real advantage for me to have a law background getting into politics. Um, I worked in the court system, the federal court system for two years, uh, and I was in private practice for a short period of time before I went into state politics. And I think what it does, it gives you a confidence and a competence that, um, to really be able to navigate the system. Yeah, without a doubt, my law degree has been my biggest asset. And that law degree, once people found out that I was an attorney and I was an assistant district attorney, gave me a level of credibility that neither one of uh, my then opponents could muster. I think being a lawyer also made it a little easier to know that you will disagree with someone and you can agree to disagree and still be able to turn the page and continue to work. It gives you an analytic skill uh, and some tools that make you look deeper and ask more questions. And I think it's important to do that though because otherwise you're going to end up with legislation that's going to be challenged by someone and ultimately that can cost a city, a county, a state, a school district a lot of money. Uh, even today with my law degree and my background I'm looked to as a resource on legal issues. Is that good intentions in writing legislation are not enough. You got to look at the words because somebody's going to interpret those words and do these words really mean what you intend? If you, if you don't have the ability to analyze uh, complex things, you often settle for things that are just not going to work. Attorneys in general are trained not only to talk but also to be well informed and to present a case. And that's what you exactly have to do when you are running for office or supporting somebody for office. Anybody who wants to get involved in politics, whether directly or in commissions or boards, it's a great way to get involved in your community, first of all. And you get to meet a lot of people. Uh, and it really gives you a chance, I think, to be on, on the ground and many times in the grassroots situation where you're helping shape the future of your community. It's really a natural, I think, a natural fit for, for people who like the law to get involved in lawmaking or interpreting the laws. If you have a passion for politics, there is no better way uh, to scratch that itch than to actually get out, get involved, and do it.